no fourth quarter and one late in the third quarter you fought. Yeah, I felt like we needed to be aggressive there. It didn't work out. Um, so that's frustrating, you know, and so uh, again, I, I put that on myself. Um, situation where I felt like we need to be aggressive and go score in that possession, given we were down seven. And anytime it doesn't go well, obviously you're, you're going to think long and hard about that decision. Overall, how did you sum up the overall game the Second half wasn't good enough. You know, we, we didn't have, make, you know, make enough plays, enough calls, lost the turnover battle. Um, they capitalized, you know, they scored in every possession in the second half. And offensively, we really walked away with essentially three turnovers, you know, so. Um, thought we did a good job coming out, you know, with the, the touchdown drive to match them, and then turnover and downs, pick and fumble, and that's that's not good enough for us. Can you speak about the play call on fourth and one uh, that Quinn came out on? What, what was the idea there? Yeah, he's one of the options, and and you know, again, the play didn't work, um, and that's a hundred percent on me. And then what about the, the third and one? You bring in the lineman. What did you like about that look in that run? You know, the third and one. Yeah, that's off the game plan. It's frustrating. You know, everybody deserves better. You know, uh, we got great fans, great support. Um, haven't done enough, you know, to, to reward them. Haven't done enough to reward our players. We, I mean, the work that goes on in this building, and we should feel more wins. We need to feel more wins. We haven't done enough to do that for ourselves. That's on us. There, there's no finger pointing anywhere else. Uh, we got to take accountability for that, players and coaches. And you know we're we're better than than what our record indicates, but your record is what your record is. We've we've earned that, and so again, we, we put ourselves in a bad spot, but it's not a spot that we can't get ourselves out of. And I know that we believe that, and we're not even yet at the halfway point in the season. And so again, there's going to be a lot of opportunity here. We just got to stick together and keep working, find some wins, and string it together. Two point nine yards per carry up, up the middle of that. How, how do you get that going? Forward? Yeah, we just got to be better in that run game. Yeah, we, I mean, we didn't have any explosives there. And so um, sometimes when you can get an explosive and kind of um, get it going a little bit, we just never got that opportunity. And um, threw the ball well, so we didn't, we didn't, it's not that I called a bunch of runs in the first half because we were moving the ball really well the way that we were attacking them. And so sometimes when you're not making a lot of damage there, um, you just keep the ball in the air because it's been successful. And, and that's no knock on the run game. It's just that's, that's an area we felt like we were really making a lot of hay. And, getting some really big plays out of it, so stuck with that a little bit. And then the second half, you know, you don't give yourself much opportunity to run it when you get down two scores and three scores. And so that's where the average comes into play there. And, and uh, you know, it presents probably a little worse than it would have been if we had kept that thing tighter and given ourselves more opportunity. The fact that deep shot to the QB, Peter Mari, was intercepted, does that mean a product of just playing and make something happen? Something that was a good play by the corner. You know, it was it was good. Jamar, Jamar got a step on him, and the guy threw his hand up at the last second and tipped it. And then he safety just right place, right time with the pick. So sometimes things just don't go your way. And, um, you know, I, I think it was a good look for it. And, and again, those guys just made the play. When did you know that you would not have C and have it done in fact in that play? Well, I mean, we, we gave it all the way up to the final final second. And it's unfortunate. He works really hard to put himself in a position to help our team. And um, just unfortunate that we weren't able to make that work. I don't know that it, you know, I left to watch the tape, but um, I felt like Cody in there did a good job. I didn't feel like um, he was hurting us in any way. Caitlin has his eight shot touchdown to Devontae Smith. Like, he had a lot of time to be able to find him down the field. At this point, with some of the inconsist inconsistencies with pass rush this year, do you guys feel like you can you can be able to get more pressure, or is it just something where right now with the current personnel you have, you feel like it is what, what it is? I feel like we got good players. Yeah, I, I don't think it's indicative of what we are as a team because I think the score is going to reflect differently than how I feel about our guys and, and what opportunities we're going to be able to capitalize on. Um, it's a disappointing day. There's no running from that. But it felt good coming into halftime that we were going to find a way to win this game. And second half, and, and it starts with the fourth down. You know, they, they score a touchdown, and we come out and go for a fourth down. We don't get it, and that's, that's heavy on my mind, you know, the entire game. And so and I think any time that happens, um, and I make a decision like that, and it doesn't go your way, you, you're sick to your stomach about it. Still felt like we were going to have opportunity. And again, then you get a tipped pick, and, and all of a sudden they run away with the momentum. So unfortunate. Um, again, what I just told the team is we're in a hole, in a hole that I believe we can dig ourselves out of. And we're just going to have to find a way to do that. When you're tied at the half, did you, did you feel like you should have been tied? Did you feel good about how you were playing 
No, I no, I don't think it should have been tied. I, we had opportunity on offense there. You know, we had a close call on a third down that, that we ended up settling for a field goal, and then we missed a field goal. So we felt like we were moving the ball. It's three possessions first half. That's as, as few as you're ever going to have. And so when you're not capitalizing on every single one of them, that's um, you felt like you left something out there on the field. What gives you the confidence that you all can dig out of the hole and kind of be, go where you all want to go? We got enough talent. We got great coaches. We got great players. We got enough talent, enough leadership. I've got confidence in him. Did you see anything schematically that they changed to attack you? It seemed like those first two or three drives, the defense was able to hold. No, it was turnovers. You know, that's what got us. So, you know, that's that's as much a mess as anything. As the Eagles began to gain momentum in the second half, did you feel that your guys were starting to play a little tighter? No, I, I really didn't. I, I think there was still confidence over there, even down seven. Um, we didn't get the fourth and one. Defense held them three and out field goal. You know, there was really nothing else they could have done aside from getting a turnover. Uh, so I didn't feel that tightness. I felt like actually the defense rose up right there and got the stop and forced them into as long as field goals you're going to get. And then we turned around and, and again, the, the ball gets tipped up and they picked off. So that's that's football. It's unfortunate. And again, I, I you know, we're just going to get back to work and find ourselves a way to get a win next week. I think everybody puts a lot of focus on Jamar, and we put it on ourselves to find ways to move him around and continue to get him targets. Zach, when you have a first half that really has only limited possessions, you said three, how does that, if any, change your thinking as to how you attack the rest of the game? It really doesn't. You know, we, we came out and um, offensively had a good drive that finished in seven points, and then, again, essentially had the three turnovers. Okay, thank you. Thanks,